Welcome to the M521 controller function switch setting guide. In this video, we will show you how to change the function switch setting on your M521 controller. The function switch setting determines how the controller interacts with different sensors and switches. Let's dive in. Step 1. Depending on your specific application, you will need to adjust the function switch setting. There are three main scenarios we'll cover filling or emptying sumps or tanks, using a pressure switch on the pump discharge and using submersible pumps in sumps with float switches or probes. Step 2. Open the terminal cover. Inside on the right, you will see two dip switches. Scenario 1. When filling sumps or tanks with float switches or probes, set pins 1 and 2 to the OFF position. This configuration ensures that the controller interacts correctly with the float switches or probes, allowing for effective control during the filling or emptying process. Scenario 2. When using a pressure switch on the discharge of the pump, set pins 1 and 2 to the ON position. By selecting the ON position, the controller recognizes and responds to the pressure switch signal, enabling appropriate pump operation based on pressure conditions. Scenario 3 When used for submersible pumps in sumps using float switches or probes, set pin 1 to the OFF position and set pin 2 to the ON position. In this configuration, the controller combines the functionality of both float switches or probes and a pressure switch, ensuring accurate control and protection for submersible pumps in sumps. Remember, adjusting function switch setting is crucial to ensure proper communication between the controller and your sensors or switches. Thank you for watching our M521 controller function switch setting guide. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please leave them in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel